the podium representing Emsford, Adrian Formo and Alex Correa. In second place, I would like to welcome to the podium at Taka Katsuta and Aaron Johnson. And in first place, we would like to welcome to the podium Kelly Rubberbera and Yone Houghtonen. And representing the winning manufacturer, please welcome to the podium Yari Mati Lavla, team principal of Toyota Gazoo World Rally Team. Now please stand for the national anthem of the winning driver. Toyota Gazoo World Rally Team. Downtown. The trophy for third place for Formo and Alex Correa will be presented by Rodrigo Roja, the Vice President of Sport for Africa. And the trophy for second place will be presented to Taka Katsuta and Aaron Johnson by Ababu Namwabe, the Cabinet Secretary of Youth Affairs and Arts and Sports. And the trophy for first place to Kale Robinpera and Yoni Houghton will be presented by His Excellency William Ruto, President of the Republic of Kenya and Commander of the Kenyan Defense Force.
Right now, photo opportunity for the winners, together with His Excellency the President. And those of us on the presidential dais, kindly let's be upstanding as we now early of the of the WRC 2024 Safari Rally taking place right here in Naivasha. May I kindly request that we all, Excellency, the President of this great nation, Dr. William Samoy Ruto, Your Excellency, the Governor of Nakuru County, Honorable Susan Keheka, the Cabinet Secretary for Youth Affairs, Creative Economy and Sports, Honorable Babu Namwamba, all cabinet secretaries and principal secretaries present, the WRC leadership, the manufacturers, partners, and all and sundry fans who are here to watch the grand Safari Rally 2024. Your Excellency, with your permission, allow me to call upon the cabinet secretary for Youth Affairs, Creative Economy and Sports, Honorable Babu Namwamba, to make some few remarks, then we proceed with the rest of the program. Welcome, sir. Your Excellency Asante Sana, thank you very much for joining us at this climax of what has proven to be a truly incredible, highly successful WRC Safari Rally. The WRC Safari Rally 2024, Imeshika And as we promised, this has proven to be the most successful of any of these events that we have hosted. Allow me, Your Excellency, to quickly acknowledge our host, Governor, uh, Governor uh, Susan Kihika, and ask her to formally welcome us and this incredible ceremony to Nakuru County before we proceed. Your Governor Tafavali, Karibu. Uh, Your Excellency the President and uh, the Cabinet Secretary and the, um, sorry, the, ch the Chief Executive Officer of the Safari Rally and uh, all the drivers, all the guests and all the spectators present. Mine is very simple. It's really just to welcome you here to this uh, final, final day of the Safari Rally. As a county, as the Nakuru County, we are really, really delighted to be the host county for a majority of the rally. And the people of Nakuru have come out in large numbers to enjoy the last few days. And we continue to look forward to Safari Rally so that we can continue uh, having this thrill around the county. And uh, as, we, as we finalize on the Safari Rally, I call upon those who are here visiting, be it from outside the country or from within the country, to stick around and visit the many areas of tourism destinations within the county of Nakuru. There are many things to see, many wild animals to see, many sites, including this very place where we are in Naivasha, Lake Nakuru and all that. And I welcome you, even next year we look forward to it. 
and we continue to enjoy hosting the safari rally asante your excellency for making the time to be here thank you asante sana gavana and let me also acknowledge the leaders who have joined us for this uh, closing ceremony honorable Je jen kehara the mp for naivasha our secretary general of the ruling party uda my brother honorable clofas malala karibu sana sg I also want to acknowledge our members of parliament who have joined us here today. Honorable Stephen Mule, member of parliament for Matunglu, and also a member of the sports committee in the National Assembly. Honorable Irene Mayaka, nominated member of parliament and executive of the KYPA, the Kenya Youth Parliamentarians Association. And Honorable Mandazi, MP for, for Chepalungu, also a member of KYPA. We are also joined here by a number of uh, our PSs, and I want to acknowledge my brother PS John Ololtua, the PS for Tourism, the PS for Performance and Delivery, Veronica Nduva, the PS for Higher Education, Beatrice Nyangala, and the government spokesperson, uh, my brother Honorable Isaac Mwahura. Pamoja na viongozi wengine asanteni sana. Your Excellency, I also want to acknowledge in a very special way our partners with whom we have worked incredibly hard to deliver a successful event and so all our partners the kenya commercial bank asante sana my brother paul russo the kenya airways um and all the other partners who have joined us to deliver this event safaricom and all of you to nasema asante sana to make this event successful and indeed to have this event here the government of Kenya has forged a strong partnership with the FIA, and I want to acknowledge the Vice President of FIA, who is responsible for Africa, Rodrigo Rocha. My brother Rodrigo, thank you very much for the time you have spent with us, and we cherish the partnership we have with the FIA. And of course, the World Rally Championship, and I want to acknowledge my friend, uh, Jonas Sebo, together with the rest of your team, Asante Nisana. And we want to assure you, in the presence of my boss, the President of the Republic of Kenya, that Kenya cherishes this partnership with the FIA and the WRC. We truly, truly cherish this partnership. We do not take it for granted that Kenya is the only round on African soil of the 13 rounds of the WRC. We want this partnership to stay on long, long into the future. May it only get better, deeper, better, swankier, better, tougher, as the safari rally is known. So, Your Excellency, let me conclude by acknowledging two things which have happened in the context of this rally. One, this rally has witnessed the culmination of a restructuring process that we have been undertaking on your instructions and with your involvement, Your Excellency, to make the WRC Safari Rally project better, more efficient, and more cost effective. We want to assure you and our partners that we'll continue this process of reforming, improving this project so that it can deliver at the highest, uh, the highest standard. Secondly, we have launched this year the Talanta Motorsport Academy as a special project to help grow the motorsport as a sport in Kenya and for this whole region. I want to thank the FIA and the WRC for mobilizing support around the Talanta Motorsport Academy. Through this academy, we intend to develop incredible talents to ensure that Kenya continues to be an anchor in motorsport. And finally, Your Excellency, in the spirit of inclusivity, we have continued to support women in motorsport. And like we did last year, this year, under the Talanta Hela Initiative, we have sponsored four all-women crews to be part of this rally. And Your Excellency, it delights me to report to you that the four women crews are still in it out of the over 50 drivers that entered this competition. Of the 14 survivors, the four women crews are still in it, telling you the strength of a woman. 
We'll continue to do so. We have also invested in our youngsters and we'll continue. We'll continue to invest heavily in growing young talents under the Talanta Hela Initiative. Otherwise, we're Kenya Asanteni Sana. You have been incredible as fans and may it continue to grow. And now it's my honor and privilege and pleasure to welcome His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya, to address us. Thank you very much. Please, let's take our seats. Distinguished participants, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon and welcome to this closing ceremony. On behalf of the people of Kenya, the many who have shown up in different parts, in Roisambu, in Elementaita, in um, Hell's Gate, in all the other stations and all the other places, I want to say to WRC and um, our partners that this is yet another moment in history when we are witnessing the only rallying event in the continent, and that is not in Kenya, it is in Naivasha. And I want to say congratulations to Nairobi County, congratulations to all our teams, starting with the Cabinet Secretary and all the teams that have put this event together. We have enjoyed Easter the way we always knew Easter to be. Easter was never complete until we had the Safari Rally. I think we can say that in the 20 years that Safari Rally has been away, this time round we have had Easter the way we always knew Easter to be. So congratulations to all the teams that have put this together. Congratulations to WRC team. Congratulations to IFA for what they are doing. And let me say to our friends, especially our neighbors, from Uganda, from Tanzania, from across this continent, you have made this event a truly continental event in Naivasha and a truly world-class event. And therefore, I am very proud to be associated with this team that has just won. We have given our young man another round. This time, he has won again this year and he has told me that he intends to win again next year. So those who are coming here next year, be ready and be forewarned. Let me conclude by saying to us, all of us, especially to the hospitality industry in Naivasha, and to all Kenyans that have participated in one way or another, we've yet demonstrated as a country our expertise, our hospitality, our splendor as a nation, our tourist attraction as a country. And let me promise our visitors that added on to what they have seen this year, next year we want to make this event a truly exciting experience. I'm going to have a conversation with the teams that have put this together. This year we have made it more efficient, more cost effective, and better. Next year, we intend to double our efforts to make it much more cost effective and I want to ask the private sector. This event today is heavily sponsored by the government of Kenya. Yet, there is opportunity for the private sector to participate in this event. I want to ask our private sector. This event is watched by 170 countries around the globe. This event is watched by 85 million people in Africa, in Kenya, and elsewhere. This event has had close to 50 television stations airing it in different formats. This is an event which every business person, every entrepreneur would want to sample. I want to invite the private sector to take over this event and manage it better, manage it well, and gain from it in a very positive way. We are willing to seed space as government. We will continue to backstop and to support this event. I would want to encourage the private sector, people in enterprise, 
to participate in this event, to sponsor parts of this event, so that we can all benefit from what Safari Rally is, the biggest event in our continent in the rallying space. And therefore, let me say finally to all the drivers, congratulations for a wonderful event, for a wonderful show, and to the men and women who participated in this event, my very best wishes. I am sure the best has won. Next year, we are looking for yet another exciting moment. Asante Nisana to the hospitality industry, to the people who have participated in many ways. Congratulations to all of us. This event has made our Easter complete and has made our Easter exciting. As you travel home, please travel safe and see you soon. Asante Sana, God bless you. Wonderful. Why don't we put our hands together for His Excellency the President. And Your Excellency, there is an award that uh, has been prepared specially for you. And I'd like the Cabinet Secretary, together with Simon and Jonah, to present it to you uh, this afternoon. It is a once-in-a-lifetime picture of His Excellency the President with a driver who drove him last time during the rally. So that's a special, special picture. And perhaps, Your Excellency, I don't know if you would enter another car or not, but from your speaking, probably not. But there you go. Eddie Kimani, I hope you're ready. I'll be handing over to you to continue the award ceremony after this, now that we are done with His Excellency presenting the award, or rather the presentation to His Excellency of a beautiful picture right there. We still have some more awards that are to be given out, and I'll request that we take our seats. We may now take our seats kindly. We may take our seats, and I'll now hand over to Eddie Kimani to take us through the other award ceremony. Eddie, over to you. A very good afternoon and welcome to the finale of the WRC Safari Rally 2024. Wakenya Santeni Sana, we are progressing on with the prize giving ceremony, and I'll jump right into it as we continue the ramp prize giving starting off in the fourth place representing toyota gazoo wrt elfin evans and scott martin finishing in fourth place please make your way to the ramp we've already awarded the first Top three finishers of this year's Safari Rally. What an epic adventure in this scenic landmark, the Fisher's Tower, right here at Hell's Gate. Onto the ramp, finishing fourth, representing Toyota Gazoo WRT, Alfred Evans and Scott Martin. And in fifth place, representing Team Hyundai Mobile WRT, Turnerville and Martin Yavioha, to be presented by Principal Secretary of Education, Dr. Beatrice Inyangala, Makofia Turnerville Ikwapi, together with Martin. Where did I go? Congratulations and well done. Kindly, when you have Principal Secretary Performance Management, Miss Veronica Nduva, to be on standby. And in sixth place, 
Representing you die Shell Bobby's WRT, Oit Tanak and Martin Yavioha. This will be presented by the Wildlife Research and Training Institute, Dr. Patrick Omondi. We do have Veronica Nduva still handing over the trophy. Thank you very much, Veronica. She is the Principal Secretary of Performance Management. Dr. Patrick Ndakwomba will stand by. And finishing in seventh place, Jordan Sedaridis and Frederic Miklot representing M Sport Ford WRT 